mass balance is like your uh, you need to account for all the material in a plant take a refinery for an example or a mineral processing plant generally you know what you are buying as a crude or a raw material and then you know what you are selling to the customers because you are paying for all this right but the problem here is you cannot track the material inside the plant at every individual unit or every single unit so it need it if you track this at every single unit there is a scope of improvement of transparency of the process and you can improve the process in 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 total you do not have any sensors on every single flow pipe so there are no measurement in certain areas even if we have measurements they might not be correct so manually identifying the plant network and all these corrections are leading up to 400 plus manual corrections per day so this is causing that 24 hour delay to perform this mass balance when you take a refinery or any process plant so some of the unit operations might be operating now and if you want to produce another product or something and you change the shift or something and then some part some part of the plant might not be operating and you have to shift to another uh, operating unit so this plant network is very dynamic in nature we could now uh, predict the plant network in real time using graph algorithms and uh, ml algorithms and wherever there are no flow measurements we are using machine learning models uh, domain knowledge etc to predict the flow measurements in real time and we have reduced the number of manual corrections from 400 to as less as 10 to 15 manual corrections so essentially what we did is we reduced the frequency of mass balance from 24 hours per day i mean mass balance one mass balance per day to one mass balance per hour this is not you know developed in one year if you have to put in one way because we have people with more than around 30 more than 30 years of experience and we use their domain knowledge and we have people working uh, with optimization ai ml algorithms and graph algorithms so it's a amalgamation of both the entire domain knowledge ai ml optimization etc to finally bring out one solution that is applicable for all the sectors to perform the mass balance in real time we integrated our algorithms for the mass balance with, uh, with the tcs into end so that we can de uh, deploy the solution in a very you know accelerated manner so refining is a very uh, you know energy con uh, energy intensive process so you need at least 1.5 uh, barrel of water to process just one barrel of uh, crude oil so if we can track the material accurately and reduce the amount of water consumption by at least 1% we can save more than 1 million barrels of water per day not just the water and also the greenhouse uh, greenhouse emissions like the carbon this is applicable to any sector any process industry where there is a material flow like this is applicable for energy like petroleum refinery etc this is applicable for pharma where you are producing chemicals so the tcs real time plant wide mass balance algorithm has multiple benefits for any process industry